The SL Chennai Open 2013. With the news that three out of the four top seeds have fallen in the singles this evening, that just leaves uh, the second seed, Janko Tipsarovic from Serbia, who will be playing against Bedene from Slovenia, and that will be followed by Pear playing against the winner who beat uh, Batiste. Bat Bautista Agut. So these tongue twisters of names are, are coming to the fore. And of course, we got some doubles action now. We got the Ratiwatana twins, Sonchat and Sanchai, taking on Somdev Dev Verman and his partner, Sergei Sakovsky. And I've got with me the our very own Charu Sharma. Charu. <laughs> Warm welcome. Thank you so much. Looked like uh, you had a couple of thoughts in your mind that you uh, wisely, I hope, chose to not go through and just say a friend of ours, <laughs> which is fine. But you're always great to be in the box with uh, Enrico Piperno. Here's Somdev Dev Varman. Well, pity about the singles, but he came up against uh, an inspired Tomas Berdik yesterday. And today, amazingly, Berdik. In fact, Berdik mentioned that yesterday while I was talking on court that another day, who Lord knows, I could have lost to Somdev. Well, he didn't lose to Somdev. He lost to a terrific trier today, if we can use that word. Very game player, Roberto Batista Agu. Good to see uh, from the Indian standpoint that Somdev is back with Starkovsky playing uh, the quarterfinals of the doubles, but they have their hands full because these Ratiwatana twins are. They know their business. Yes, but Somdev has a good partner in Sergei Sakovsky, a Serbian volleyer. Pretty solid from the baseline too. Good singles player. I think it's going to be a very interesting doubles tie. But like you said, the Ratiwatana twins just play doubles for a living. And uh, Davis Cup players, uh, they played in the Asian Games. They've had a lot of good results on the ATP Tour. So they are definitely a team to be reckoned with. We got doubles action after three great singles matches and a fourth that finished on an outer court. And the center court here, 11.25 at night in India in the southeastern city of Chennai. And we're nearing Charu's favorite hour. <laughs> well, I don't have glass slippers, that's for sure. But, you know, it's been rough in the singles seed, suddenly in the quarterfinal. And, of course, in uh, the doubles, it's been devastating for the seeds. Um, the top four, all gone. So we got the, the stats for Somdev Dev Varman, 27 years of age, 5 foot 11 inches tall, 73 kilogram. He currently lives in Charlottesville in Virginia in the United States. That's where he went to college, University of Virginia. Turned pro in 2008, career best ranking of 139 in doubles. Present, uh, he doesn't have a doubles ranking because he's 
ranking fell off because he was out of out of not playing tennis for so many months. So that's Somdev, Dev Verman. And his partner is Sergey Stakovsky. He's 26 years old, he's six foot four inches tall, he weighs in at 80 kilograms. He's from Bratislava, the capital of Slovakia, the land of Dominik Herbati. He got a doubles ranking of 232 and he turned pro in 2003. He'd been up to 33 in the world. So his doubles ranking has slipped these last couple of years. And they're playing against uh, the Rati Vatana twins. And this on the right court is Som Chat. That's on chart. That's on chart. Rati Vatana, 30 years of age. He weighs in at five. He's at five feet nine inches tall. Not very tall. 71 kilograms. He currently resides in a city not far from mine, called Bangkok, and uh, he has an ADP ranking of 65. He turned pro in 2004, and he had a career best ranking of 39. That's on chart. Rati Vatana from Thailand. And on the left court. Is his twin brother. He is Sanchai Ratibatana. He's 30 years old. Age. He's 30 years old too, being his Sanchai's twin. And he weighs at he weighs in at 70 kilograms. He currently resides in Bangkok, and his ADP ranking is 65. He turned pro in 2004, and his career best ranking has been 39. So this is Ratibatana twins. From Thailand. So they continue to warm up. And this is the highlights of the Thomas Burdich, Roberto Batista Aguts quarter final. Two hours and 20 minutes they played. And at the end, the Spaniard just wore down the number of one seed. Solid hitting by both players from the baseline. Algo just using the Burdich pace. Very comfortable with the pace he was getting receiving the ball at. And just the short backswing, guiding it into the open court like he did there. We await uh, the, the last Indian standing. We have Somdev Dev Verman in partnership with Sergei Stakovsky playing his doubles quarterfinal against the Rati Vatana twins there on center court. And uh, Charu and myself will lead you through this match after we talk a little bit about Vijay Shanti, one of our sponsors. And they hosted a party at the Sansara at the park last night where the food was excellent. And you can see uh, the guests having a wonderful evening. The Vijay Shanti party at the Samsara. Well, I must say that uh, one of the many specials about the ESL Chennai Open is always the sponsor activities. And there are many, virtually one every night. Some, of course, parties. Others, uh, such as the kids' day out or uh, cooking and whatever else. They certainly keep the players busy. And tennis fans those associated with the game equally busy off the court. So a lot of interest uh, this tournament generates around the country. A lot of uh, tennis fans and ex-tennis players and friends who watch this uh, telecast do send in SMSs and messages uh, telling us how much they enjoy the tennis. And I must tell you, Charu, 
friend of a uh, friend of ours in Hyderabad is watching it very closely today. He doesn't want us to mention his name, <laughs> but you know who I'm talking about. No, I don't. I mean, uh, could it be Rajit or <laughs> who could it be? I'm, I'm not sure. Yeah, he's been sending me these really <laughs> hysterical messages. Janan and I are having a big laugh at. And uh, so people like him, you know, people who played the game, who follow the game, and who have. Uh, the man in black is back. <laughs> Hope you're listening. Yeah, we've been. I've been telling the guy to come and actually watch the tennis here, but unfortunately, Chennai is just a little too far from Hyderabad for him. <laughs> and also, the, the parties don't long uh, last long enough for him here. Yeah? <laughs> well, anyway, but people like him, you know, they're great enthusiasts, and I think tennis is such a well-received sport in our country that uh, it's just wonderful that this event continues to happen, and I've heard it's going to continue for a few more years. I hope. So this is what everybody looks forward to. This is the probably the, the, this is the best tennis one gets in India live, and what a better city than Chennai, the home of uh, the Krishnans, the Amitrajas, and of course a tennis crazy city. And of course, it's a very special time of the year, the first week of January, the first tournament around the world. There are a couple of other competing tournaments, but uh, in Chennai, great time of the year. And despite the fact that we keep saying it's warm and it's humid, it is the best time weather-wise in Chennai. And um, when it when the sun does go down, the temperatures are certainly manageable. And uh, most of the players love coming across to Chennai. Such is the treatment that the, the tournament uh, dishes out year to year. Players are, are certainly very appreciative. And of course, it's due to one of, one of the reasons for this tournament being here is that man on the screen, Arden Tennis Lover, the Vice President of the All India Tennis Association, Karthi Chidambaram who is a very big supporter of the game, and of course, Ready? part of the TNTA and the IMG who right. together bring this event to this beautiful stadium. So anyway, we are opening up the doubles quarter-final. And you, of course, are our resident expert in picking out the twins. So, Sanchai, Sonchat. It is now Sonchat serving. Just shows that uh, Somdev and Sergei Starkovsky obviously haven't played too much together. Both went for that ball in the middle. Popped it up for that smash. point. Sakovsky and Dave Barman, some brilliant gets. And ultimately, the Radhi Vatanas falter this one at full stretch. And this, finally, the winner. They got caught in an uncomfortable position early on, but then closed in on the net. net Somdev and Sergei. Again, a good second serve here by Rati Watana. Deep on the Somdev backhand. So 
two game points to open this final match of the night. So with that uh, good serve out wide, the Rati Watana twins hold serve and they lead by one game to love in this doubles quarterfinal action. Again, I'd like to remind all our viewers, doubles on the ATP Tour now is a little different. They play two regular sets and they follow it up with a super tie break. And uh, with that, they have what we call no ad scoring. That means when the, bo when the games get to deuce, the single point decides the game. Sergei Stashkovsky, a wonderful servant volleyer, uh, volleyer that he is. <laughs> Sending a few. Helping the insects on their way. Insects. Take wing. Yeah, but quite clearly, uh, the six foot four Stakovsky is the best server out of the four. A little bit of confusion. There was a bit of noise when Stakovsky served. First serve. There was some um, uh, movement behind. I think, and the umpire put his hand up to stop play. Oh. 15 all. We've got to say a rather routine forehand volley. Missed by Dave Varman. Again, good solid defense by the Twins, forcing the error on the Stakowski backhand. So, small window opportunity here in the first game of the Stakowski serve, 15-30. Huh. That's how to get out of a small hole. Ah, a challenge by the Rati Watanas. Looked in, seemed to swerve in. Oh, well. 30 all. That's well it. So. Forty thirty. Rocky Watan has uh, two challenges remaining. Very firm in the net. I think the Rati Watanas were testing some there because he'd missed a couple, kept going back to him. And much as uh, they didn't do too much with the volleys, the Rati Watanas ultimately just withered away. And Stakowski holds. Classic doubles there. Two at the net, two on the baseline. Good offensive volleying by Somdev Devarman and Stakowski and some great defense by the twins from Bangkok. Trying to be a little cute there, Stakowski. Played a nice 
dinky drop shot here which the twin runs down and then with no backswing he tries to hit him in the body with that forehand but uh Yeah, super forehand by Somdev. Forty, fifteen. Maybe a little too late for this game, but it was superb down the middle, great pace, top spin, just in. Wonderful pick up by Sanchai Rati Watana. So with that they hold serve and they lead two games to one in the first set. So we got late night doubles for you from the southeastern corner of India in the wonderful city of Chennai. We're watching the Indian Ukrainian pair taking on the boys from Thailand. An interesting doubles tie. Stakowski should have done a lot better with that. Easiest forehand volley is nice high forehand. But uh, didn't quite catch the middle of the racket. Should have put that away. Gave the boys from Thailand a bite of the cherry twice. <laughs> Not going to mess it up this time. say Somdev serving very efficiently now important that uh, they hold their opening service games just to get off to a steady start unfortunate some day of trying to change things up went for too much angle Ratibatana twins at the net are pretty strong and which is why I suppose some day have just tried to go for a little bit extra failed 30 40 oh, the late poach by Starkovsky Uh, so they've suddenly in trouble. Yeah, two break points as the format is in doubles. And one here, and if you should come back to deuce another one. So, oh, game, Rati Watana. So with Eight that uh, two, one. forehand down the line, the Rati Watana strike first. They break serve and they lead by two games to love in the opening set. Well, that game turned around quickly. Some they are serving well enough, 30 love, and all of a sudden, four points gone.
some they're pretty effective at the net but eventually the Rati Vatana is too strong you know I can safely say that's probably the best doubles point of the whole tournament he had everything in it and uh, eventually uh, the Rati Vatana twins getting on top of that volley net the serve Well, the Rati Watanas are making it look only too easy. Not big servers, around 180, but uh, very effective. You know, I was about to say they're playing That's relatively error free tennis, and luckily I didn't say that before. The missed volley but of course far fewer for their errors compared to their opponents today Again, superb doubles here being played by the Thai boys good first serves nice and deep and of course their volleys at the net have been absolutely outstanding A point away here from a comfortable lead in this opening set. Serving at 3 1 and 40 15. Throw in the double. Two double faults here. And that missed volley at the net, which was uh, regulation for doubles players. It's been a weak game. And now it could go either way. Stakowski and Dev Burman desperate to break back. That was well done by the Ratia Vatana twins. Game. Good solid doubles. And they race to a 4 1 lead here in the first set of this doubles quarterfinal action. Coming to you live from Chennai. Time. Little rough for the last Indian standing, as Rico very eloquently put it. Somdev Dev Varman along with Stakowski. Fifteen lap. More than a spot of bother. And the Rati Vatana twins. Well, they had a bit of a scare in the previous game. But they finished it off in style. And a handsome 4-1 lead in the opening set. Much better. Too much air by Sanchai. And Stakowski this time didn't miss.
Well done, Son Dave. Looked like a slightly late reaction, but uh, the return wasn't hit at any pace at all. And Son Dave able to reach in time. Straight down the middle. Good place to go. Well, that might have been sailing wide, and I wonder if that put off Starkovsky. It's a regulation volley. So a relatively easy hole for the Devarman Stakowski team. They're still way behind in this opening set and uh, the efficiency and the understanding between the Ratibatana twins for the moment makes them a superior team in this quarterfinal Rare Only just bit of a miss hit from Somdev. Another wonderful serve down the middle, just about clipping the line and an easy hold. Is there a challenge? I think uh, there may just be. Although, uh, yes, well in. Call stand. Game. Of course, the call stand. Stakowski really shouldn't have challenged. In fact, after he did, he walked uh, onto the bench. So, the Rati Uthana twins 5 2 in the opening set. Welcome back. We are in, in nearing the midnight hour. And so on, Dev Dev Verman from the near side. We're serving at two games to five. The Watana so far have been very efficient. Good solid doubles players, both of them. So they're throwing in a double fault at 15 love. Oh. 
30-15. Again, a good first serve by Somdev. But uh, very effective. Yeah, pretty efficient performance here by the Ratiwatana so far. Except for those couple of double faults that he threw in in the last service game of Sonchat. Otherwise, it's been pretty good. As you can see, they're covering the net beautifully. Good over overhead here. And then Sanchai at the net, just putting away a nice simple volley cross court. Net. The serve. And a miss hit return by Somdev Devarman. Giving the Ratiwazana twins a pretty simple put away volley at the net. Net to serve. What is it? Again, a good deep serve by Sonchat. Ratiwatana sets up set point number one. So after 27 minutes of play, Ratiwatanas are at set point. 5-3 and 40 love. Okay, a huge and serve out wide set. at 173 Ratiwata kilometers an hour. Six and the Ratiwatanas win the first set by six games to three in 27 minutes. We're all set for set number two, but the Ratiwatana twins are looking a touch too strong, too good. Too well oiled, the machine, the Ratiwatana machine. I don't know what Stakowski and Dave Varman can change in the second set. And, uh, nice athletic leap by Somdev Dev Varman. Didn't catch it from the middle of the racket, but did enough damage. The one thing that I'd like to see as a change is Somdev just returning better. He uh, was a little out of it in the opening set. Oh yes, good decision to let that go. I did start out by saying that Stakowski's serve is possibly the best out of the lot. But uh, even that was broken in the opening set. Better start this time around, though. Mm, perhaps just wide. Oh, long. Well, <laughs> both went for it. And perhaps it was Somdev's uh, shot because he could leap and get it on his forehand. Well, Stakowski probably had to use the backhand. Six. 
same situation. This time, Som, they've kept it in. Beg your pardon, even Stakowski would have used his forehand earlier on. Anyway, Dave Arman, Stakowski hold the opening game of the second set. More emphatic display. They've obviously come back uh, after having spent some time on quality thought after losing that opening set. And it seems to have made a difference. And a lot of this is because of the last Indian standing. Somdev Devarman does have many fans in Chennai and of course tennis fans around the country. It's the quality of returns that we need to see from the Stakowski De Varman combination. 15 love. Not yet. Third double here by Sonchat Ratiwatana. He served two earlier in the first set, back to back, and then all of a sudden he throws in another one in this game. In this the opening service game for the Ratiwatana twins. by the twins at the net. Sonchat went for the overhead. Sanchai closed in at the net. As you can see this, just watch this again. He closes in and gives himself an easy backhand volley. So two game points. Stokowski hitting a backhand out of the playing area. And the Ratiwatana twins hold serve. It's one game all, second set. A very smart play by the twins there. Great topspin lob. And then Sanchai put his volley in exactly the right place he should have. Where you see a replay of this. It's a great topspin lob. And then Somde does well to get that back. And he absolutely places that forehand volley in the right spot. So, love 15 on the Somde <coughs> serve. Love 13. And a beautiful return, setting it up nice and deep. Son chart just closing the net, the beautiful backhand volley. Always added pressure when you serve and decide to stay back, and that's the way Somdev plays doubles. Still continuing to struggle with his first serve is the Indian. Again, a wonderful volley by Sonchat. Out in front, keeping his wrist nice and firm. Somdev did well to get to that ball. You see a replay of this. It wasn't an easy volley, but he made it look so simple. Good get here by Somdev. Can't do much with that. Sanchai had a pretty easy overhead. Got three break points. And... Uh, Somdev saves one with a good first serve.
How close was that to the baseline? Yeah, just not missed by much. Saves two. Needs one more first serve. This is the first. I'd like to see Stakowski help him out here, maybe. Look to go across, put a little pressure on Sanchai. Uh, good second serve by Somdev. Sliding point. Receiver choice. Not over yet, though. So Sanchai has decided to take this game point. Three good serves by Somdev to get himself out, to a, out of a tight situation. Yeah, good hands. Good hands by Somdev and Stakowski. Get the ball there, being down love 40. Somdev and Stakowski come back and hold serve. And the lead by two games to one in the second set. miss by the Radhiwathanas. Two challenges remain. Not much damage done. He was leading 40 love. Again, Two just so off. rock solid at the net. The Rajivatana twins. We're on serve. Those ground strokes came rocketing at them, but uh, just great skill with the volleys. Doubles. Wonderful skills here being shown by the boys from Thailand. Great defensive work. Forcing Stakowski and Somdev at the back of the court. And then this wonderful backhand cross court rip by Sanchai Ratiwatana. I've got to ask, where was Somdev? Good kill by Somdev eventually, but in that previous point, he went for a walk, Charu. <laughs> moved in the wrong direction, directly in front of Sarkovsky, leaving the entire ad court open. Just a mental error there. Ball, Ball please. Ball. 15, 30.
better by Somdev. Move forward and that return was made. Got the volley above the net. And an easy put away. Again, good hands by the Indian at the net. Just missing that backhand volley was Somdev. So with that, uh, Sanchai has decided to take the juice point again. Game, Devon Stackhoff. They lead three games to two. Stakowski comes up with a good first serve there. And yes, they lead by three games to two. The combination of Dev Varban and Stakowski in the second set. Much better second set for the Verban Stakowski. Are on serve. Oh, a miss it. Stakowski apologizes, but they'll take the point. Opportunity to see whether Stakowski and Devarman can uh, get in a better set of returns of serve. Oh, well played. Point of the match so far. The Rati Vatana is absorbing a lot of pressure at the net, but eventually Stakowski. That was good enough, if not near brilliant. Well sent back, and then the big move. And visiting the Rati Vatana era. This could be their big moment. De Varman and Stakowski. One good return at this point of time will make the Rati Vatana twins worry a bit. all it takes good dipping return and Stakowski didn't miss the volley there we go dug out very neatly done by Stakowski straight at the body To such great work by both Sarkovsky and Dave Barman. He's not amused. I'll definitely go down as the miss of the week. <laughs> uh, there was a prize for that. Sergei Sarkovsky would win that hands down. 
Such a lot of good work before that miss, though. Great point. Oh, well. <laughs> <laughs> he atones, makes that overhead, and break for the first time in this doubles quarterfinal. Oh, Sunday De Barman and Sergei Stakovsky up a break in the second set. And then lead 4-2. And I suppose all is forgiven. <laughs> they can both see the lighter side of that miss. Didn't prove to be too expensive. But they have raised their game. Most of their ground strokes now a lot more accurate. Sonchart returned and stayed on the baseline. Could have worked the ball to that side of the court. Instead of picking to go down the line a little too soon. So a little trouble here on the Somdev serve. He's trailing 15-30. Well, he was love 40 in that previous service game. Oh, a big miss there by Rati Vatana. Watana. You both please. So with that, uh, the Rati Watanas break straight back. And Somdev Devarman and Sergei Stakovsky lead four games to three in the second set. We are live at the SDAT Tennis Stadium in Valluvar Kottam, Chennai. This is Enrico Peperno with Charu Sharma coming to you from this beautiful southeastern city of Chennai. And uh, we've got late night doubles action for you. Somdev Devarman and Sergei Stakovsky. I've lost the first set to the Ratiwatana twins from Thailand and it's on serve in the second set. Ratiwatana serving at three games to four. 30 left. Wally at the net by Rati Watana. Just playing, playing very solid doubles. Again, good point. Drill this one straight at Sergei. Unable to control that volley. So 40 love. 
quick service game here for Sanchai Rativatana. Game Good second Vatana. serve. Four games all. So with that, they tie it up at four games all. <laughs> In the second set, quarterfinal action of the doubles. Coming to you live and exclusive on from Chennai. Finish it. Not the third time you get an opportunity, the first time. But such has been the defensive capability of the Ratiwathana twins. As Tarkovsky and Dev Verman sometimes bereft of ideas about how to shut the point out quickly enough. Oh no! Long! 15 all. Well, like I said, you've got to finish it off sooner. So they've had two bites of the cherry earlier on. Yeah, very clearly missing it by a couple of inches below the baseline. Desperation now to the Stokowski serve. Went for a change up. High kicker. Didn't work out. Oh. He was in the right position. Well judged by Somdev. Was well within range. Pulled out quite cleverly at the last microsecond. Good finish to the game by Stakowski. And after 56 minutes of play, Somdev, Devarman, and Stakowski lead five games to four. Second set. This is when it matters most. We're on serve. The Rati Watanas have been broken once in the second set. Net the serve. Surely that's what Stakowski and Dave Verman are telling themselves. We can, we've done it once, we can do it again. And what better time than now? Game 10. Oh, just missed. I 
I think I've said this before quite a few times. It's just the quality of returns from Starkovsky and Dave Varman making such a big difference. And of course, no question, the Ratiwatana twins, regular doubles players, professional doubles players are much better at the net. But that was a given anyway. Victory. An exchange at the net won by Starkovsky. That should please him. Get a smile or two out for the Ukrainian. Just too clever. Only 143. Amazing angle. Maintaining the eye, even on the second serve, such as their level of confidence, the Ratiwatana twins. And that's the way to do it. Game Ratiwatana. Five years old. That didn't work out too well for Stakowski and Devarman, did it? Again, the returns virtually absent. They have improved at the net, though, as the match has gone along. And Stakowski has been serving reasonably well. Devarman, too, has dug himself out of a couple of holes on his service game. Play there by Sonchat Rativatana came in off a good return. Love 15. Put the pressure on Somdev, forced him into the error. One thing you can't find fault with is Somdev's athleticism. Ran that uh, cross court down very efficiently. Good serve down the middle. Rativatana's challenging the call on the right center service line. What was calling? That's very, very close. Either just caught the edge of the line or missed it, but. Was swerving away. Very, very close call here. Just, just missed. Unbelievable. Oh, no. oh it's my got to be word. the narrowest margin, Rico. Can't get closer than that. Comfort zone, rallying as he would in a singles match, and up the line for and rally, and eventually very clever. That lob was just such a good option. Not an easy shot here. Just took his time and just rolled it over Sanjay Ratiwatana's head. Are you going to serve and stay back? You must need. You need a lot more first serves. That's what I mean. He's gonna be hurt. So a spot of bother here for the Somdev Devarman serve, serving at 15:30. Again, every service game in the second set, Somdev has been behind. The forehand sails long. And with that, two break points to the boys from Thailand. 15.40 on the Somdev serve. He wriggled out of it a couple of times earlier in the set. 
Definitely needs to make a few first serves here. Again, good game hands by the Rati Watana boys. Six games Came in well behind that serve. And now, when we return, the Rati Watana twins from Thailand will serve for the match at 6-5. Welcome back. We watch Sanchai Rati Watana serving. 6 5, second set, in the upper set. And we really need the team of Sakovsky and Dev Varman to make a few good returns. The first one sails wide. Really haven't made too many returns, have they? Stakovsky and Dave Varman. Let's continue playing the I formation here. So Dev needs to make him play. Oh yes, stepped in, climbed into it, and up the line. I'm not sure tactically what that was the right thing to do, because that serve was just hanging on, hanging in there, and. Uh, the down the line return is the much easier one, the easier option. Well, Sergei Starkovsky has been trying that back off backhand return for the last, well, 10 times, hasn't made it. But uh, this one was a critical one and it came low and dipping to the Ratiwatana ankle. 1530, Ray of Hope. Oh, that return going straight back to. Son chart at the net. So 30 all. This men's doubles quarterfinals. Sanchai going for the big one wide. Sakovsky again to look at the second serve. Again, good solid doubles by the Rathi Watana boys at the net, just keeping the wrist nice and firm, waiting for Sarkovsky and some Dev Dev Verman to make an error. So with that, the boys from Bangkok are at match point and a shot at the semi-finals of the SL Chennai Open. Game set a match. With that, they close the match out very comfortably, winning in straight sets, 6-3, 7-5. And like I said earlier, the last Indian standing has now fallen. Well, the Ratiwatana twins, too strong, too professional, too good. They are a regular doubles team and uh, the scratch pairing of Somdev Dev Varman and Sergei Starkovsky. Well, individually, they might be better players, but they couldn't combine well enough today and they go down in the quarterfinals. Better display in the second set. But uh, just not good enough against the rock-solid Ratiwatana twins, particularly at the net, including that last point. That's right, Charu. What has been a wonderful day of tennis, and uh, we've had three great quarterfinals on center court, followed by a good doubles match. It was a good matchup. We had two guys who were pretty solid from the net, and uh, two guys who like to play from the baseline, Sikovsky and Somdev Dev Varman. At the end of the day, it was the boys from Thailand coming through in straight sets, knocking Somdev Dev Varman and Sergei Sikovsky out. <laughs> so. We look forward to tomorrow, <laughs> where we'll have good singles action for you, semi-finals, singles and doubles, all four matches on centre court. 
And of course, now we'll wait for the order of play. We open up with Bedene, who beats St Stanislav Arinka, the number four seed today. He will take on the number two seed, Tipsarovic. And then we'll have the giant killer from Spain, Roberto Bautista Agut, taking on the man from France, Mr. Pear. And then we got doubles action. We got semi final of the doubles. Bergman and Emmerich taking on the Rati Watana twins. And Klaassen and Munro, the, the team that knocked out the top seeds, Daniel Nestor and Mike Gubadi, playing Pear and Warinka. So that's the semi final action for tomorrow. And uh, on behalf of myself and of course my dear friend Charu Sharma, wonderful having you with us. And we look forward to seeing you tomorrow evening at the same time.